everybody, welcome to the Operation Flame Strike campaign. This is being hosted by Beasts of War. Uh, you can check out the rules for it on beastsofwar.com and it will be five weeks long um, in conjunction with Corvus Belly. Now we are bringing you each week the mission um, which is taking place on Paradiso on Flammy Island. And this first week we are doing engineering deck from ITS 2016 in the Zurong power plant. My Yu Ching will be defending the power plant against the military orders. I should have brought Teutonic Knights. You should have brought Teutonic Knights. I click on that, that we're on Paradiso. You are on Paradiso. The actual team who are from the Paradiso. order that is on Paradiso. Der, der, der. That's okay. Uh, thematic, like thematically, it would have been cool. Um, but yeah, no, we will be playing um, a 300 point ITS game uh, with uh, engineering deck, and we'll walk you through the armies we're taking, all the open information, uh, the actual mission structure and scenario from ITS 2016, the special campaign rules for this week, and we'll get started. So here we are set up for engineering deck. Now engineering deck, um, brand new for ITS 2016, is an objective room mission and has five consoles. One, two, three, four, five. Now the game is all about the consoles. If you connect the same number as your opponent at the end of the game, you get two objective points. If you connect more, however, in at least one, then you will get five objective points. A connected console can be detected with a willpower roll. Um, you get a bonus to connect it if you're a certain kind of specialist and um, they can be switched on and off for either side. So if I connect it for me, if Owen later on gets in contact with it and connects it for him, it will cancel my connection status and put it on him. It's like a switch, it flips back and forth basically. Um, there's a fifth one in the center room of, um, or the center of the objective room in the center here. And the objective room can be held um, just like securing HVT. And if you hold the objective room, you will be um, getting three objective points at the end of the game. So there's no round scoring here at all. There are two classifieds in play. And the objective room itself is a saturation zone, which means you are minus one burst if you are inside of it during the game. So getting in this, uh, the room early and trying to shoot out of it, it'll actually penalize you for being inside it because you'll be uh, basically reduced by one for your burst. Your arrows will be at one, but like a link team, their, their arrows will be reduced down to one. Um, and, uh, you know, it makes it a little easier to assault it, basically, because the firepower coming out of it's not so great. So there we are. Now let's take a look at the forces. So here is my 300 points of Yu Ching. Um, from left to right, I have a uh, remote here, Total Reaction HMG, Celestial Guard with, uh, guard with a um, Kuang Shi control device and light grenade smoke launcher. Uh, and then we've got two Domaru, one with a double action close combat weapon, the other one with a... Uh, EM close combat weapon. I have a Sheen with MSV level 2 and a HMG. I have a Mech Engineer. I have the second Yao Kong with Ford Observer um, and Sniffers. And then we've got a pair of bow troops, one with a contender and boarding shotgun, the other with a combi rifle, a camel marker. In the second combat group, I have a Zanshi hacker, a Zanshi, and a Shaolin monk. So there it is, 300 points, two combat groups of Yu Ching. So here's 300 points of military orders. We've got the Seraph with his attached Oxbot. We have a Trauma Doc with two Palbots. DeFerzen with his Spitfire Hacker. Um, we have a Hacker Order Sergeant and then three Order Sergeants with Constantinos and an Order Sergeant Sniper. And a Link Team. So there it is, 300 points of military orders. Rolling off now to see who is going to be choosing Turn Order and or Deployment Order. Pass. You pass, I also pass, but you beat Link me, so you can choose. Turn order. You gonna go first? Yes. Okay, I will choose Deployment and Deployment Order. So I'm going to take this side, and I will make you set up first, all but your reserve, Vinny. All right, so here we are deployed, and some notes on deployment. One other special rule this scenario uses is um, that it's an indoor area. So all levels of AD 3, 4, and 5 are unavailable. You can't jump into this because we're inside. Um, and that means that all you can do is inferior, or inferior AD and also parachute us, which means you can come on the sides. So that represents you coming in a different avenue of advanced basically in the interior of the building. Um, it's also worth noting, just like always, this building is infinitely tall, so you cannot see over these walls or climb them. And any of the walls here you see with a black top are also considered to be infinitely tall. So we have some very um, indoor sort of like arena terrain going on here. Now we are deployed, mech engineer prone, Total Reaction HMG here with some line down onto the uh, Link team and basically just that sniper hiding behind the wall. Um, a Celestial Guard with the smoke also in line of fire. We have the Shaolin Monk with his smoke grenades and the two bow groups with their bow troops with their H uh, MSVs in behind and then my double action uh, Domaru. A Zanshi here and then Zanshi Hacker and the, uh, what's it, the um, uh, Sheen with the HMV hanging out over there, and then a final Domaru and my forward observer bot. Then we have my camel marker up front. Uh, this is the enemy HVT. My HVT is hanging out over here, 
And on the Pano side, military orders, the link along with the trauma dock hanging up behind this wall. Uh, we have the Seraph just getting ready to get busy and go open some doors or put some bullets into the other man. And then over here we have Defersen, um, the two pal bots, and the hacker. All right, so um, that means we are on to first turn. I'm going to use a uh, command token to reduce your order pool by two. So you're down to eight orders. Okay. I give it to the link team. Okay. I'm going to make my sniper the link leader. All right. And they're just going to stand idle. There. All right. Uh, I am going to shoot you with my total reaction HMG, and then I am also going to special dodge smoke with my celestial guard. Okay. Going to put all my shots into your HMG. Sounds good. All right. So unopposed with my smoke, we'll just roll to see if it goes out. Uh, I'm going to try and put it. Oh, let's say um, to just. I can go up to 16, still get plus three. So let's say right here, 15 to go out. And it's not even remotely flat, so let's put it in the box. 18's gonna miss. Yep. And then I have four shots with my TRHMG, hitting on 11's, plus three mastery for range, and you've got plus three uh, for range, mastery for cover. Plus three more for being a five-man team. That's right, and so. Additional three, shot. Yeah, three for being late. Three shots on 15's. Do it. Uh, we get a nine as the highest. All right, it's so you get a one. 10 or an 11. There's a 10, cancels it, and you get yep. hit once. Armor effectively four behind the wall. He's okay. Good. Religious. And I do. Okay. Going again. Same thing. Yeah, same thing. See if my smoke goes out. It does not. 15. Uh, we get a 12. No. Oh, seven. I need to crit. 11. Nope. Nope. You hit me twice. Yep. So that's four armor saves. Okay. Because uh, it's DA. Yep. Damage and 15. I am armor of three. Three right now in cover. So I need to be 13 plus. Blam, blam, blam. Uh, three. So I'm the last level of unconscious. Yeah. Actually gone. Another order frame. Okay. Uh, once again. The sniper is going to be the leader. Uh, they're going to get a move order as their first one. Sure thing. These guys are just going to vault the wall. As we all know, it's shorter than they are. Okay. Arrow. We're going to dodge smoke. I'm going to put three sniper rounds into you. Okay, so I need a 14. Uh, I need 15s again. Okay. Mm, 10 is the highest. 12, cancel all. So I'm going to put that right there. Another order for them. Constantinos is going to advance up to this wall. Now I can go prone at the end of my movement as well, right? Uh, no, start of any short movement skill. Start of the short? Yeah. Okay. So I'll just walk up, and these guys are going to move up as well, and just kind of spread out. Sniper's going to stay where he is. Also, we're going to make Constantinos the leader. Sorry. Oh, second short skill. Uh, I'm going to shoot your guy who just threw that smoke with Constantinos. Okay. Dodge. I guess you should have, or yeah, you can't declare. Yeah. Uh, we're at 18. Yep, so you're range. minus six. So I'm a physical 10, do your nines to hit? Yep, four dice because link team for plus one. Yep. We get an, an eight. eight and a six. Six cancels the six, I get hit once. Yep. Um, I am armor four right now, so 10 plus. Good, Good. I will choose to fail my guts wrong, go prone. There we go. I'm gonna give one more order to this, uh, this link team. And this guy's just gonna walk into the corner here and he's gonna go to there. And Constantinos is going to go prone. Okay, who's the leader? Uh, we'll make Rando the leader. Okay. And that's it. Mr. Seraph in order, along with his kill lock. And if he walks out, he's basically visible by that Domaru. Yep. Already. What are you armed with? Uh, the Domaru? He's just got a chain rifle. He's okay. got kinematica and dodgy and stuff. But I'm not going to die. Okay. So he's going to walk up. Uh, Mr. Littlebot's going to follow along. Okay. Just to here. Arrows with these two, it looks like. Uh, so it's going to be probably just these two. Yeah. So the bot is going to try and shoot you. Why not? Because it's terrible at dodging. Um, and the uh, kinematic guy is going to dodge. Okay. I'm going to put two shots into each. Okay. So 18s against my Domaru, and I need 14s to dodge. Crit. Crit. I don't crit. I don't cancel. So take a wound. And I shrug the other one. Yeah. All yeah. right. Going for it. But I need 15s. I get a 10 and a 14. I pass, but get hit twice. Yep. So 14 against armor zero in cover so uh, means I am going to be 12 plus. One, but two, fail two, so I'm double unconscious. Shorter. I have one left after this. I'll just move that. Uh, he is just going to advance up to cover. Okay. And his associate is going to just sit in the doorway here. Number is going to dodge. Okay, I'm going to put three into him and one into your unconscious bot. Kay. So, 18s. One, two, three. 
Uh, 14, 15 is going to fail. So one, two, three. Uh, so you hit three times. I'm actually good. There you go. And one for the little robot. Make another armor save. Go. Uh, nope, gone. Just bend in order. My Seraph is going to go on suppression. That's a spearhead token. And I, re yep. or I'm going to reveal my lieutenant. And okay. The version's going to go. And he's just going to move, move up to these little boxes here. My two remotes are down. I'm going to spend two command tokens, leaving me with one more. So put two guys from my little group into my big group, and that's going to mean that I've got a grand total of ten orders again in that pool. All right, so in Petrus order, I'm going to move four this way. No, I'm not going to be able to be seen. Um, and then I'm going to chuck some smoke. So I'm going to try and put a smoke grenade right here. Uh, not that it's going to do a whole lot against Mr. Tons of Guns, but I also have MSV level two, so why not? So we'll put it right there. On a 16, it's gonna do. We're gonna spend his uh, irregular order. He's gonna move four inches over to here, like that. He's gonna throw another smoke grenade. Try and put it right there. Center's definitely with an eight. So 16 again. It's gonna go off. All right, order on the sheen. Sheen's gonna tuck out here so that we can maintain contact with the cover. Let's see the seraph arrows, because obviously the seraph's out of line of fire. And then we're gonna try and shoot some guns at it. So that's gonna break his suppression to dodge. Okay. Um, so you're at minus six to your physical. So I'll put you at 10. Okay, and I've got plus three for range, minus three for cover, so I need 14s. All right. Bam. Uh, there's one. Okay. Armor. Is, armor seven goes to 10. Okay, so five or less. You fail. You're good. You're good. So you're gonna try and fail religious test here to so pass your willpower. Or pass to move. Pass, pass to move, right. yep, you go ahead. Pass to make him back out of the way. And he's just gonna move two, but he doesn't quite get around the corner, staying into that box. Okay. Put another order on Sheen. She's just gonna slide out, maintaining contact, so that she can see you again. Yep. Uh, obviously, you can't do anything right now. Dodge. You can dodge. Yeah. Okay. I'll dodge when you shoot me. I Might as well. Yep. I can't before. That. <laughs> so four shots. Not touching cover anymore. Nope. Gonna fail. Fourteens. Gonna hit you. Actually, sorry, it's seventeens now, but still only twice. So 15 against armor 7 now, 8 or less, take a wound. I'm going to fail his guts test. I do. You do, so you can move again. And he's just going to get a round of fire. Yep. Bow's going to get a order. He's going to move up 4, this first sword skill, to here. No arrows. Okay. Second one, he's just going to move touching. Another order. He's going to peek out so you can see Constantinos. Okay, I'm going to shoot you. Okay, I'm going to shoot you back. You get two burst. Yep. I get three burst. Combi plus three. I'm going to be basically plus three minus, yeah. or plus six minus three. Yeah, you got it. Go for it. Fifteen. We get a five. I get a nine. Hits you. Armor, Armor four. four. Oh, I have mimetism. Uh, uh, did I nine still hit that. you? Yeah. That uh, was a crit, actually, so you didn't even need armor. Yeah, so he's unconscious. He's unconscious. Sir, I, have a, I have a visor, so it's not a crit, but you still filled the armor roll. Yeah. Yeah, because my visor ignores your mind. Right. I knew I knew there was a reason it didn't matter. We're both using MSP2 <laughs> to shoot through this mother. That's yeah. right. So another order. Uh, gonna idle, then I'm gonna shoot him again. Alright, so hitting at plus three, minus three, so twelves again. Make one more armor roll. He's out. No. Spend an order on my engineer. She's gonna stand up, moving. No yep. one can see through the smoke, so she's gonna end in base to base with this. Other order on her, she's gonna move around to here and then interact with it. Fire 13, gonna pass, that's gonna belong to me. Order on my hacker, going to move move into base to base with this, like so. Willpower test, another order, gonna fail. Second part of my short scale, sorry, I was gonna move back to here just so I was out of line of fire. Last command token in order, I'm going to coordinate a bunch of moves. So we are gonna include the sheen this Celestial Guard, the Mech Engineer, and this Domaru. And their first skill is going to be to move. So the Mech Engineer is going to move over to here. Oops, that's mine. Oops. Celestial Guard is just going to stand up, even though I just knocked him down. Whoop. Maintain contact. He's going to move back around the corner. And then this Domaru is going to move four. Heading forward to here. Arrows, so second short skill. Mech Engineer is going to vault this. And go hang out right here. So we got to stay where he is. This Domaru is going to move four to go hang out in cover. And we'll stay where she is. And that is turn. So turn one complete. First order for you. Top of two. Seraph's going to go. Yep. He is going to walk and tow this so he can see Mr. Smoke. Okay. Should be able to see her before I see that guy. Yep, for sure. And little robot is going to 
be a robot and follow. Sounds good. Arrow. Uh, we're going to fire a smoke grenade. I am. So I'm going to place my smoke right here. Okay. 15's for you, 14's for me. Uh, 12 and a 4. 18 is going to fail, so you hit me I twice. Am. Armor of... 5? Five? 5, yes. It's armor 2 base. Uh, sorry, armor 1 base, actually, okay. for that guy. Yep, so armor 4, so 11 plus twice. I uh, may pass one fail one, I'm unconscious. Other one right. Move to the Seraph, and he's basically just going to walk up to this wall. Okay. And Oxbot is just going to follow along. Over to you. So obviously you had vision when I walked out. Indeed, we will combi you. And shoot him. Yeah, go for it. So 15's for you, 15's for me. Uh, 14, I have to roll 15. Nope, gonna fail. One, two, three, four. Armor one plus three is four, so 11 plus four times. I've done it before. One. one. All but one. Of one. It's okay, trees. <laughs> He's unconscious. Another order. Mr. Oxplant is just gonna prowl. Okay. Staying out of line of sight. And he's gonna go this direction, up to this door. Second short skill, yeah. Uh, these two are just gonna continue on their way. He doesn't want to get seen quite yet, so he's just gonna go to there, and he'll just tow out a bit. All right, next order. Okay, we're gonna slide this Oxplant, stay in cover until he can see those two in the back. Sounds good. Seraph is gonna also stay in cover until he can see them. His wings are a little Crazy, but he wants to stay yeah, in cover. No, no, I no problem. Now. Yep. Sure. All right, so we are going to dodge with the Domaru. We are going to fire with the Bow Troop um, into the Ox Bots, and that's that. Okay. So everything's going into the Domaru. Both guys, of course, it will splash and splash. Um, so I'm just going to do the dodge for the Domaru right now. He dodges on a 14. Doesn't. Hitting on 18s. Three. Yep. Okay, so 14 against armor three. I need to roll a 11 plus, sorry, 12 plus here. He's dead. Straight rolling into the ox bot with my, um, what's his face? Dumber. Mr. D uh, no, or the bow troop. Yeah. Plus three gonna miss. Limbs are save for the bow, sorry, for the downed um, bow. He has to roll a 14 plus. He's fine. For the downed domero, he has to roll a 12 plus. He's fine. And for the last bow, he's dead. He's fine. Everyone's unconscious. Next order. Gonna look at that fella. Sweet, dodge smoke. And he's just gonna move up. So your second sort of skill? We're just gonna move again. Okay. And Mr. Oxbot's just gonna move out. And Seraph's just gonna stay in the cover right here. Great. And smoke, 17. Pass. 16 for him, he's not a dome room. All right, so he's in the smoke. And so is your Oxbot. Marker's gonna use its order here. Okay. And it is going to be... Revealed. Revealing itself in a moment, because it's touching this right now. So there is a marker there and it's going to move. Okay. And just walk around the objective, basically. To the other side, yeah, it makes sense. And reveal itself to be a FO. Order Sergeant FO, yeah. Order Sergeant. Gonna try and interact. Push the button. Go fail. You got Do it, it again. Try again. There we go. Pass. Next order, we're gonna give it to my uh, trauma doc. doc. Everyone over here is unconscious or not out of sight, so she's just gonna vault the wall. Her pal bot's gonna move. Her pal bot's gonna move. Second short skill, she's just going to move up next to this guy. Palbot's going to move up to here. Another Palbot's going to keep an eye out. Going to um, trauma dock the dock, or push, move it first, I guess. She'll just yep. move zero. And he'll just kind of sit here and watch. And she's going to try and push the button. And she'll try and push the button. Got it. Trauma docks are willpower bad. Yeah. Fail. Yeah, Nothing but your LT, yep. Yeah. Do we try it? Yeah, we do. Okay. Gonna walk over to the door. Gonna open it. He's gonna try and open it. Willpower good. Hack the door, willpower 14. Passes, all Quick. the doors open. And all the doors in the objective room are now open. So my last uh, token to bring the Shaolin into the primary order pool, I currently have one, two, three, four, five, six orders. Shaolin, moving into melee. Well, little guy's gonna have a flamethrower. Okay. Because he's given up on life. I'm gonna dodge. That's right, I'm gonna, in, well, I guess technically it's an, in, it's a move into melee and then I'm engaging you afterwards. It's, it's whatever dodges once you're already in melee. Okay. You guys gonna spitfire? Sounds good. Before. So you're at 15 straight dice. Fail. I need a 13 to dodge the flamethrower. I pass. He's not gonna bother using his electric pulse because I'm close combat 23 plus 3 for martial arts level 3 and you're at minus 3, so you're just gonna try and dodge. Crit 4. Um, yeah, crit 4. My, uh, sorry, you're minus 6. Yeah, that's right. Crit 4, okay, go for it. Crit 4. I have to roll anything. I do. Didn't so you get hit. I don't know. Physical 13. Armor not. Patang. Patang, all right, and then you shoot into combat with and then the. My spitfire kills. Spitfire, it. go Nine for or less. it. Nine or less. 
Nine. Yeah. Great. <laughs> All right, so I get crit unconscious. And I'm unconscious. Putting over in the dome room. Uh, gonna move out this way so that we have line of fire only. So we're just gonna come around here and we're gonna get a line of fire only to your Palbot. Palbot. Like so. Furzen's gonna try and uh, sucker me or gotcha me. Uh, yes. I'm gonna throw an EM grenade at the Oxbot. Palbot. Palbot, sorry. So you get your dodge with him. You'll be at minus three because you're a bot. And I'll be at plus three, minus three, so I'm hitting you on 14s. Physical 10. Seven. Seven. Nope, Crit and time. I'm hitting on a 14. I hit you, so EMA grenade goes off, and you can try and hack me. You need an 11, but that's neither here nor there. Sorry. Uh, oh, Mimitism, that's right. Miss. Nope, you're gonna fail. Oh. Grenade's gonna get both, breaker, and damage 13. So the bot's BTS. Uh, he's down. He's down, so he's immobilized two. Defersion's BTS three. He's fine. Okay, guess check. Fail. Fail, Can't yeah. move. The rotor on the Domaru. Domaru's going to attempt to Throw a grenade at the immobilized bot, who can do nothing. You can try and hack me in if you like. I'm gonna dodge. Okay, so I'll, I'll, be, I'll be hit you'll, by You'll, you'll dodge if I hit. Yeah, yes. you'll dodge afterwards if I hit. Yep. So I'm at minus three for mimetism, minus three for cover, plus three for range, so I need a 11. It's gonna hit. So you can dodge at minus, minus three. So he's physical uh, 14, needs an 11. It's gonna fail, so both of them get, well, it doesn't matter what the bot does, BGS. but the person is bad. Yep, you need an 11. I'll spend an order on the hacker. And she's going to try and interact with this objective on a 13. Nope. Spending an order on the camo token here. It's going to move, move. So it's going to move, well, it's going to move four through this doorway. Like so. An arrow from your sniper. Um, well, these two are going to try and discover you. Yeah, might as well. Just because they're isolated doesn't mean they can't look at nope, you. Nope, that's true. And he's going to hold his arrow. Or okay. wait, or whatever it is called. Cool, sounds good. I'm just going to move again. Okay, go four, two here. I think they're both in plus ranges for discover checks. Yep, 14 for defersing. Got to pass, so I'm discovered. Bow by watch. Okay, all right, another order on him. He's gonna step out and then step back and deploy a repeater. Last order, hackers can attempt to interact with this again. Gonna pass. Three, uh, you are isolated by the EM round, and that means that everyone's a regular this time unless you want to spend some command tokens to make some regular orders. Oh, that's right, I can do that. You can. I'm going to do that for four. Okay. So the remainder of the link team, all having their orders converted into regular orders, everyone else remaining a regular. So you can use his regular order. Now I can just walk away because you're unconscious, right? Uh, you're not in base to base with me. This guy is? Oh, this guy? Yes, he can, yeah. Yeah. He can just leave. He can cancel engaged. Yep. So he's going to walk trooper. past you, basically, because okay. you're short to here. Okay. And the big guy is going to just walk over as well. Vaulting here. Okay. Uh, actually, you know what? Got lots of room to stand back a bit. Stand right here. Attempt to possess your tag. I am going to spit right, spit fire into your guy and flame your guy. Okay. Uh, he'll dodge. So two shots into the dodging Wu Lang, uh, including the flamethrower, and then possession will be face to face with you uh, from the hacker. So two face to face, 15s for the tag, both fail. I need a 13. I pass. So it is Overlord, uh, and that is damage 14. And that's it, you're possessed if you fail. You uh, fail. Uh, yep, 16 ties it. So, so you're possessed. Two shots into the dodging Wee Lang. Double hit. Minus six. Uh, Cover and camo. Plus three, minus six, 18, crit 12. Okay. And I pass, but don't do it, but I do ignore the flamethrower, so I'm gonna go unconscious. Armor roll. I'm okay. getting the hacker. Yep, he's gonna just move with his irregular order. Okay. And second irregular order, he's, or second half, he's just gonna move up again. Sounds good. My trauma doc's gonna go using her irregular order. And this little pow bot's gonna move. Um, I'll just walk over to here. Cause he's got nothing to do. I'm gonna attempt to hack him with my uh, little guy here, or my hacker rather, and do a gotcha. Second skill, uh, he'll be just doing nothing and she's gonna try and push the button. 12 passes yeah. just, uh, and I need a 13 or less. And I fail. Use a regular order. On my hacker, he's just gonna move up to the wall here, and he's gonna try and uh, immobilize two you. Okay, we'll reset. Immobilize one. Gotcha. Uh, I am willpower thirteen. Okay, it's I think verse two in active turn. Pretty sure that's the yeah. one. Uh, crit. Crit. I've passed, but don't do it. So I'm gonna immobilize one using a regular order with the T order sergeant now. Yeah. He's gonna walk four. We've established that this is taller than me. Yep. 
So he's going to walk four more up to here. Okay. Order on the Tio guy. I basically don't know if I can move out in such a way as to still get cover. No, I don't think you'll be able to from her. Like that? No. So I'm going to just keep going for okay. my first short skill. So I'm in and out kind of thing. Yep. And ARO. Okay, I will shoot you with my HMG. Yep. And he'll reset. Shot into the HMG, two shots into my Domaru. The face to face with the HMG, I'm at a 14, you're at 12. Not a crit. Not a uh, Doesn't hit. <laughs> against, yep, against him, 15. One. Uh, one hit, okay, not a crit, so he needs an 11 plus to be okay. No, unconscious, and the reset Pass. goes off. That's what I'm doing. We forgot one small ARO here, which was the, uh, I forget about him because he's my Seraph. It wouldn't really have changed what you were doing. He's within nope. 24, so he's minus three. Yep. He's only BS 12 though, because he's possessed, so he needs a nine. But Crit. he crits you, and you're unconscious. We're on your link team. Uh, we're gonna keep Rando in charge. You're gonna move. Four, and four, and just around here, and up to there. Okay, who's the link leader? Uh, Rando in the middle here. Okay. And the second, second half of short skill. skill. And they're all just going to continue moving up now that they have removed all opposition. That's right. Last order. We are going to make the sniper the link leader. Okay. They are still within, yep. And they're going to move. Uh, he's just going to move into the room to there. You'll be able to see that hawk spot. Okay. He's going to move into the room to here. He's going to move into the room and just be in by a hair. And he'll just tow the doorway. Short skill. You traitorous, traitorous big guy. <laughs> He's going to just sit here to try and stay out of... Ah, he'll... There's nothing good. There's no good plan. Nothing just, I can do. Just stay there so I can air pulse you. I know, right? <laughs> he'll move to... He'll stay there. Yep. He'll back into the corner here. And he'll walk straight into the middle of the room. Great. First order. It's going to go on the sheen. I've got four this turn. We're going to move four to here. I don't think anyone has ARO. We're going to move four again, staying in a line of fire that sniper, to here. Another row on the sheen, we're going to just touch the wall and then slide out until we have line of fire on that sniper. Yep. He's a sniper rifle, double action shots. He's yep. going to get one in ARO because it's... I think we're outside of eight. Yeah, we're just outside of eight. Uh, one in ARO because of the saturation zone. Yep. And I'll get three back into him. Um, I'll be at zero mod. Uh, we're both in cover, so I'll be at 11s. You'll be at... Yeah, I'm in cover. Yeah, that's, that's, why, right. that's why it's 11s. Okay, so yeah. I will go down to 9. Okay. So 1 at 9, 3 at 11s. Do it again. Crit. Just crit him. Nope. Oh, it was a 10. Uh, hit you three times. <laughs> so that'll be 13 plus three times. Armor 4. Vaporized. So 11 plus, that's right. Yeah, armor 4. Still vaporized. Sheena's going to move 4, hurtling everybody to just go stand in the room. Right here. You're not a hacker, are you? I'm not. No brain mashing? Nope. So they're just trying to isolate you? Okay. Defers in and other guy? Okay. And all three of them are going to shoot you? Okay. I'm going to shoot one on each. That's Why not? One shot each, broken link, uh, plus three for range, and then uh, one shot. Yeah, that's it. So plus three for range. Yep. You're uh, minus three for range? I'm minus three for range, that's right. So I'm going to be hitting you on 11s. We're all on 15s. Okay. So first one, uh, going left, left yep. to right. Hits. Yes. Crits. Dead. Down. Next one. Second one. Misses. Miss. Hits. Dead. Down. Third one. Do it. Hit. Oh, cancels. Right. And we tie for the room. Yeah, at this point. Other guy. Yeah, they got you both so, times. So it's um, gotcha so it's damage 13 against my BTS. So it's damage 13 against my BTS of 6, so I need 8 plus first one. Bad second one. Bad Super doesn't bad. really matter because I just need to block the final order. We're going to go on to the hacker. She's going to go 4 and end up around this corner here, hurtling everything. My arrows because no one can see me. Second one, we're going to go 4. We're going to hand this door and we're going to swap our... Objective to secure HVT. All right, so end of the game. I have won two consoles. You have won two consoles. So that ties us for two objective points. Um, did you get any classifieds? Nope. Okay. Uh, the room is tied because both sides have non-null troopers in it. Uh, and I have got one classified, which is secure HVT, because uh, I'm within eight inches of your HVT. And that is game three, two. 
All right, so there you go, nail biting finish. We managed to pull it off with a total of three to two for Yuching and the Zurong power plant. Um, so thanks guys for watching. We will have each week this month, more Infinity for Operation Flame Strike, um, another new one every single Friday. So see you next week for week two in the campaign. Until then, I'm Ash Zoen.